I think it's so important that we understand that when God provides some sort of vision for our life, that he will provide a way to get to the place that he wants us to go. But also there's a reminder that it's going to be difficult. It's not going to be easy. Just because you were given something by God to do for your life does not mean that the steps getting there will be so simple to get into, right? It's gonna take some time. It's gonna take some hardship and discipline to get where God wants you to go, but it'll be so worth it. And you'll recognize that even though it's difficult, it's challenging, it's hard. If the glory of the Lord is revealed, then we ought to be rejoicing with that glory. We ought to be rejoicing knowing that the Holy Spirit is working within us and he's provided a space for us to live according to his word and according to his truth every day of our life. Be encouraged knowing that if you are in a trial right now, if you're in a tribulation right now, and if it's for the glory of the Lord, rejoice in it because you know that when your faith is tested, you have a chance to grow deep roots in the Lord, not in the world, but in the Lord. And the Lord is the one that you want to be just like. You don't want to be like this world that tosses by the waves of the wind back and forth. One moment there for this, the next moment for there for that they are for that. You want to be a person that is consistent, that can charter the waters of this life with consistency, knowing who you are. And you do that when you spend time intentionally with the Lord, who is your guide, who is your lead, who is everything you need on this journey of life.